What's one good way to win an argument? Use the prep method. What is it? Find out in this video. From the Oak Wall Studios in Las Vegas, Nevada. Hello there, this is Jesse Oakley III speaking, and today's topic is all about the prep method. Now, what is the prep method? The prep method is a good strategy to use when you are in a debate or when you're arguing or you're trying to discuss your position. There's so many people out there on video that have a position, but they don't know how to explain why they stand on this position. Sometimes they just shrug their shoulders. Sometimes they insult other people to ask them questions or they just walk away thinking that they won the argument, which they really didn't. Now, there are so many people that are, I hate to say the word, but indoctrinated with some beliefs that they are willing to stand to their beliefs and just not see the other side or go underneath the surface to see if this belief is tested or is it really effective. And in order for me to discuss the prep method, you have to use your argument using the prep method because it gives your argument credibility. It puts your position more concrete and chances are you might win by using the prep method. Now, what is a prep method? Prep method can be broken down into four letters, P-R-E-P. -E now, I'm going to explain to you the strategies on using a prep method right now. The P, the P is a position. Where do you stand in the position? Say that you have a certain type of thing that you want to stand on. You stand in a certain position that you feel passionate about. The R is the reason. Why are you standing on these, this position? If you're standing on this position for a strong reason, then you have a good setup. And here's a key part, the E. The E is an example. And when you use examples, please use some good facts or good percentage or good numbers behind your reasoning and your position. The more facts you use, the credible it sounds and the sense, more sense it will definitely make. And then P, you close it up with the final position. There you have it, the prep method. The position, the reason, the example, and more position. When you use the prep method, you'll be able to counter the question that's being asked with the position, the reason, the examples, and the final position. And when you use the prep method, please use it in a sense where you're calm, you're cool, and relaxed and confident about your position and where you stand behind it. Don't just go fly off the handle. Don't go yelling at people. Don't go get into arguments. And don't throw eggs at the person that's throwing questions at you. Just simply be calm and use a prep method. And once you're able to be calm and use a prep method, then chances are that you'll be able to feel confident about yourself because you know where you stand and you have some good concrete background on where you stand. This is Jessica Good Thirst speaking. And until next time, you take care and have a great day. Bye. Thanks for watching my video. If you like this video, I have other videos right here that you can check out. And feel free to subscribe to this channel, ring the bell, and you'll get some more words of wisdom from yours truly, Jesse O'Clear III. Until next time, you take care. Remember to always have a great day. Bye.